and a sheriff chases a violent twister as it chews a path of destruction through a small Texas town. This is your warning, this is not a test. This is destroyed in seconds. Tampa, Texas. A tornado is forming on the edge of town. Sheriff Randy Stubblefield keeps an eye on the approaching funnel cloud as he monitors the emergency radio frequencies. When he heads out to get a better look, what he finds is bigger than he expects. This twister is a category F4. Inside its massive vortex, winds are cranked up to as high as 260 miles per hour. I'm right here with 100 yards from it, David. It is moving to the northeast. Its capacity for destruction is astounding. Get everybody inside. This is one big... As Sheriff Stubblefield watches, the tornado begins to move into the city of 20,000. Flash as power lines snap. Residents retreat to their storm shelters as the tornado tears apart every building in its path. Cars, trucks, even a full-size RV are sucked up and tossed through the air. measures at least 200 yards across. Sheriff Stubblefield tries to keep up with the moving twist. Okay, come across right now to the intersection of Alcock and Price Road. Alcock and Price Road. He can only watch as it chews a path of destruction over three miles long. Here we go. Finally, the violent storm begins to lose its force. In its wake, 43 houses and 23 businesses are leveled. Countless trees and cotton fields are destroyed. Hundreds of homes and businesses are damaged. An estimated 1,000 people are out of work. The cost of the destruction is nearly $20 million. The tornado sends five people to the hospital, including an 18-year-old shot by a downed power line. Because of local preparedness for violent storms just like this, thankfully, there are no fatalities.